Though much effort is being put into farming, most of the smallholder farmers are facing challenges in accessing reliable markets due to poor road infrastructure. The 2018 Malawi Population and Housing Census report shows that 38% of villages are not accessible by motorized vehicles for the five-month period of the rainy season. The challenge echoes across the country, Malawi. Mata <laughs> The Ministry of Agriculture, in its realization of roads, as one of the catalysts for enhancing farmers' access to reliable markets and a drive to agricultural commercialization is rehabilitating and upgrading roads through agriculture sector-wide approach support project, phase two, ASWAP SP2. The project in its second phase is working in 12 districts of the country with funding from a multi-donor trust fund, MDTF, comprising of the European Union, Irish Aid, Flanders Government, USAID, and the Norwegian Embassy under the administration of the World Bank. So far, the project has improved more than 1,109.5 kilometers using labor-intensive methods and 75 kilometers of low-volume seal technologies connecting important market trading centers. In Lilongwe, farmers surrounding Mitundu Trading Center are all smiles as the much sought Mitundu market is easily accessed. <laughs> Thanks to the ASWAP SP2 for upgrading Mitundu Kampanzite Road to Tarmac Road. The ward councillor, Tsekarani Gansiriri, underscores the need for having improved road network in the area. Zombeo zao jaga kula, umagwani saka, 
Kwa nipeza nazo kuti kumitundu wa gulisa. Enasa kumamita nazo kutitao ni forensi ya ulibu ni wambili wa nobo. Binton Kutsaya is a member of parliament for this area. Ngo ulo si makona njira. Ngakele mpakuche ni magari moro. Onye muna katumi. Ama kona njira kusona. Sona kubwela kwa sewa. Uli mangila kwa sewa. Ngo ulo kwa tandiza. Ndipa kutandiza kutuku na dilarino. Kutandiza kutuku na dilarino. Kumasu antamdu na wini kwa kwa basi. Tufetu wande uli malonda za kazo vuru. Sayama Mantambi Road in Mulanji district is ready for use. Farmers will be able to ferry their agriculture produce to reliable markets. Bwera kwa nse uku, nyingo toko za kwa asapu, kuti apanga chintu cha chikuru, panupa mene ziri, tikango kuma gea wani kono, kapena koro, mapita baka tukafika kumedo. Ipen peso, nga tikunga kare maganizo ena, kamene pari keza inu paja, mplati pitiza kwa kafika mina, chaku mpara uko. This is Palombe district. People are all smiles. This 13-kilometer road will ease the mobility of farmers to access markets. Desk officer for ASWAP SP2 in the district has this to say. There are various uh, interventions that are being implemented under ASWAP, especially on the component 2 of ASWAP SP2, uh, which is laws construction. So basically, uh, eight laws were emerged to, to be constructed. And out of these eight, uh, five, I mean uh, seven, were to be rehabilitated using the intensive labor. And the uh, last one was to be upgraded. So the Palombe Mpad and Kulame Lord uh, was emerged to be uh, upgraded with uh, uh, low volume seal. It starts from the Boma uh, up to somewhere in Pada, and uh, the length of the load is 13 kilometers. So this project has helped us to, uh, to open the market linkages uh, through um, the construction of the roads. So uh, we would like to appreciate uh, uh, the ASWAP project because it has really helped to open up the markets and the farmers are really appreciating because they are easily transporting their uh, produce from uh, the uh, production center to the markets. The poor road network in Chitipa district in the northern region of Malawi is now a thing of the past following the upgrading of some roads in Misuku and Chisenga areas. The upgrading of roads also covers Nchisi district. Madali Tomanda of Dumba Vula village in the district has all the reasons to express happiness with the upgrading of Nyalavu Ngombe Road 
as this who is mobility. Uh, Mercy Gamanga echo sentiments made by Madalitso. The road infrastructure has not only provided rural communities with easy access to markets, but it has also created job opportunities for community members for the improvement of their livelihood. Currently, Aswa Broad projects have employed over 14,000 locals in different parts of the country. The project's road infrastructure component seeks to improve the road network for farmers to access reliable markets and reduction in transport costs and generates employment. The communities experience an improvement in quality of life whilst the nation moves forward in economic development.